Hey guys, it's David from TheUnlocker.com and today I'm going to show you how to load a custom ROM on the Samsung Galaxy Gear Watch. Uh, there really is only one popular custom ROM for this device, uh, but that's the one I'm going to show you how to load because it has a ton of great features, including the ability to get rid of Samsung's signature verification so that you can use this on other devices besides the ones approved by Samsung, plus a ton of other really cool features. So let's not waste any more time and let's get started. Okay, first, this only works on Windows, uh, just because Odin, which is the program we're going to use, the Flash, only works on Windows. Um, then, you need to root your Galaxy Gear first, so click on the link that's uh, under Section 2 in Step 1. Do that entire procedure, it's not that hard, I promise. Uh, we even have a video for you. Then, come back to this one to continue. Then, you're going to download the ROM by clicking on that link there. Take you to the developers page. Now, please... If this ROM helps you, if you love it, please consider donating or at least thanking this developer for making this. He put in a lot of time and effort and you can see it's got a lot of cool features. One of which is disabling the Samsung signature verification, which means you can use this on other devices. So we'll scroll down. Under download, we'll click SourceForge. Eventually it will start to download. Save this to your desktop. While that's downloading, we're going to download Odin as well, which is the program we're going to use to flash. So click on that link and save that as well to your desktop. Then we can right click the Odin folder once that's done and hit extract all. Hit extract. And double click the exe file, hit yes, to open that up. Then we're going to put it into download mode by holding down the power button. And keep holding it until rebooting comes up on the screen, then we'll let go. And as soon as we let go, we're going to tap the power button five times. And it should give us this screen. We'll tap the power button once more to get to download. And then tap and hold it for three seconds. And let go. And it should put you into download mode. When that happens, we can put it into our little charging case thing. And plug it into the computer by USB. Okay, then you're going to tap AP and select our ROM file. Hit OK. Then, as long as it says added in here, give it a second. And hit start. Wait for it to finish. Eventually, the device will reboot, and it'll say Pass on this screen. And once it reboots, uh, you can tap Nova Launcher and hit Always, and you'll get this home screen now instead of your other one. You can add widgets to the screen, just like you would any other Android device. Um, it has a lot of awesome features. Uh, if you want a full list, please check out the link underneath this video on our site for all of the features that the developer added into this, including live wallpapers, um, being allowed to use other devices with this instead of just Galaxy ones, um, and tons more. If you want to check out other how-tos that we've done for this device, click on rooting, jailbreaking, then click on Android, then click on Samsung, and then click on the Samsung Galaxy Gear. You'll be presented with all of the how-tos that we have for this device. And there you go. I hope that helped some of you. And if you'd like to check out some of our other tips and tricks or other how-to videos, feel free to follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Google+, or subscribe to our YouTube channel.